We want to complete our model by connecting the body to the frame. This time we're going to use the sketching environment where we can draw lines, arcs, circles and define constraints between them. Here we define all the rules we want to apply to our sketch and then we can assign measures. As you change any of the measure, the sketch will update according to your constraints. You can also turn a geometry into a construction geometry which will be shown as dot line. They will only be visible inside the sketch. We can now trim out all of the known required parts and keep all parametric. We can also create points and reference other objects to them. For example here we can use this to decide the distance from the center and to position exactly the sketch on top of the frame. Now it's pretty simple to mirror this sketch on the other side to make instances that you can drag away and position and to make a mirror of them too. You can always change your mind on any decision by changing numerically or visually the position or the shape of the objects. After moving up all of the sketches we are willing to extrude them with the up to body function of the extrusion so that we get one single solid out of this operation. Even after many operations we can still now change our mind, uh, go editing the sketch and change it and everything is gonna update. Last couple changes and we are ready for the last operation which is a trim through a couple circles that we project onto the object. This way we successfully connected the body of the chair with the frame.